Mike, and today I'm taking a look at the Nickelodeon Double Dare home game released in 1987 by Nickelodeon and Pressman Toys. Okay guys, I don't know about you, though this box is big. I have to hold the camera to capture this scene because it goes over the review station. If I just lay my camera down here like I usually do, this thing's way too big for the camera to capture all of the box. By my hand, as you can see, that's how big this thing is. So anyways, besides the box size, let's go over the packaging. So going over the packaging, as you can see, you have Based on the hit TV show from Nickelodeon and the Double Dare logo with the checkerboard pattern at the top, the exciting game of fascinating questions, answers, and outrageous physical challenges. Then you show challenge demonstration of, that's challenge 83, ball crawl. And then right here, it's challenge 87, paddle battle. And then you see two kids demonstrated, demonstrating the stun helmet, featuring the versatile Double Dare stun helmet, and a hundred incredible physical challenges. So that's really cool. It's a race against time. There's the Double Dare timer, and the exciting question and answer round. There are two kids playing the game with one kid asking the questions. One thing I really like about the box art for this is that it's not photographed. It's not like real kids, it's actually like professionally, artistically drawn, so that's one thing I really like about the box. Though, in, on the, in the background, it actually has the Double Dare pink-yellow bean pattern, like the Family Double Dare Fox set did. And then on this side, Double Dare, the exciting game of, qu of fascinating questions, answers, and outrageous physical challenges. Then, it's for two or more players, you just eat enough, features a thousand questions and a hundred physical challenges. Same art on the front as well, then. Same thing on the other side, and then on the top. Similar, but on the back. You get a little bio on the game, and what's included. I'm gonna cut for this. Now going over the back of the box, there's the Double Dare logo based on the hit TV show from Nickelodeon. The exciting game of fascinating questions, answers, and outrageous physical challenges. Teams take turns trying to guess the answers to a thousand fascinating, fun questions. If you're stumped, dare the opposing team to double the dollars. They can double dig it back, and the dollars double again. Come up with an answer or take the physical challenge. In the final obstacle course round, anyone can come from behind to win. It's a race against time. The Double Dare game brings all the fun and excitement of the hit TV game show home, but without the mess. And the game has been t fully tested for doability with kids and adults. And then there's some legal stuff where the timer was made and such. There's much again the game of visual representation. So there's the Double Dare timer, Double Dare dollars, physical challenge cards, then, he, this, as this kid's demonstrating all the stuff that's included in the game, such as foam rings, double dare disc and strap with built in plug adapter, foam discs, squeezers, cup, goggles, basket, the double dare stun helmet, foam balls, another foam ring, another foam disc, and the swing ball and paddle. A good portion of the physical challenge actually used the paddle a lot, so that's one thing to note. So that's the packaging overall nice. Let's take a look at what this thing includes. I may actually have to go down to the floor to show it. Okay, so the review station turns out to be way too small for showing all of this. So I'm going to go up to my round table and I'll, do, I'll show all the pieces for you guys. Okay, so here's what the game comes with. It's going to be hard showing it with the camera holding one hand and only my right hand showing everything. So going over what's included, you, all, you do get a Double Dare t-shirt order form. This pretty much you fill it out and you send uh, your credit card number or check or money order to this address and you'll get a Double Dare t-shirt with the dueling D's on it and the as this description says a yellow and blue Double Dare logo so that's really cool I only have the blue one with the Double Dare splat similar to Super Sloppy Double Dare's logo then you have the instructions so I'm gonna have to open these up so it's got battery warning. This is how like you assemble the things with the plugs, the helmet and such, how you play the game, and with all the physical challenge instructions. I really love all those doodles. Really like it's really 80s style. Then if you had any comments or concerns with the game, you'd write to Pressman Toy Corporation, Department D D, fitting for the department for Double Dare the game. 745 Joyce Kilmer Avenue, New Brunswick, New Jersey. 08901. That's actually like a 25 30 minute drive away from me. So. 
You do also have your question cards and a little slider here, and the question, the answers are blocked with red, so you don't see the answers until you slide over them. Then you have your physical challenge cards. There are 50 cards, but with only 100 physical challenges. Only 50 cards with 100 physical challenges, I meant to say. Like, it goes up to 50 cards, though. You turn to the back, and it's like 100. Number one has 100 on the back. Then, I'm going to cut to show you the rest. What else do you get? You have the Double Dare Timer, which this may have actually been yellow. Since mine was used, this may have been faded yellow from sun damage, or it may actually be, ju it may actually be just a white sticker because, as you can see, it has the checkerboard pattern. So, we'll never know. Though, it's basically like one of those game, like board game timers. You just turn it around. Oh, it's actually on start. I mean, you just turn it around, and then you hit start. I really like the fact it's a stop start timer. But it makes an annoying ticking noise. That's that. Then you have the basket and the squeezers, along with double dare dollars, which I haven't even touched since I bought the game. You get four foam balls, though one of them you attach to a string and this plug to form the swing ball. You have four foam balls and these plugs for attachments to like the helmet, the the basket, the double dare plug, and the racket. And here's the double dare plug, I forgot to show you that. Oh, one plug's rolling away on me, I'll get it later. It's basically just a yellow, like, almost like a knee pad, though. It has a strap attached to it, and the Double Dare logo just pretty much plugs onto it. So there are a few other pieces before I get to the stun helmet. We have the cup, which you collect the balls in. We have three foam discs and three foam rings. I think they're actually meant to fit inside the rings during packaging, so that's why they're so small. They have the Double Dare racket, or paddle. The ba those two plugs on the front are intended to fit with the basket, so that's really cool. Now let's move on to the stun helmet. Now moving on to the Double Dare stun helmet. I have to give props to the guy who designed this entire system. It's just like one of those stun helmets you see on Double Dare, any version, but definitely it's perfect for the game's usage. Oh, sorry, just wanted to hold it too close to the camera. As you can see, there's the Double Dare logo and the goggles. Even though the goggles are listed separately, I just keep them plugged in. You have the ear flaps as well. There are multiple plugs around this thing. And demonstrating that, as you can see, there's this plug I'm connecting with the cup. And say if you were doing that physical challenge shown in the box, Paddle Battle, you'd strap this system to your arm. It's the Double Dare plug with the swing ball attached with the connector. Then you take the paddle and try to paddle it into the cup on top of the helmet. That's really cool. And there are over a hundred challenges, so if you ever get the game, or you have it, there are many other uses for this thing. And it's almost like they're infinite. So that's what's included in the Double Dare that's Home That's pretty much the Double Dare Home game itself, guys. I got this around this time last year on eBay, so... It's around like it was around like twenty five to thirty dollars though. You could find these used for around that price, but they may go higher. You may find these sealed. This is the most popular version of the Double Dare home game out there. There is a board game called Double Dare that was released to tie in with Double Dare two thousand. Though there is a sequel to this game, the Pressman version, which was seen in like the nineteen eighty nine version of Super Sloppy Double Dare called Wet and Wild Double Dare. It features water, and of course it includes the stun helmet, but the piece in the game that has the most attention to it is the Double Dare Hydrant Pump. A few pop up on eBay, rarely, though Amazon has them for like 84 bucks, and that's ridiculous. I may just stick with finding one on eBay, and of course I'll review it if I find one. So, thank you for watching, guys. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Thank you for more reviews coming your way, and I'll see you guys next time.